little bit of anxiety is normal, but we don't want to take it to a level where we become alarmed or in a state of panic. I think we want to make sure we're really using reliable sources to get our information. And I don't think we need to be looking for information all day, every day. It might mean avoiding places like social media that are really sensationalizing the coronavirus and sending people into a state of panic and alarm. I think that instead of um, using our support network of family and friends to alarm each other, we want to use them to provide support for each other. In times like this, um, the CDC is recommending things like avoiding big crowds, um, large gatherings, so we can do things like that, and it's important to keep ourselves healthy. Sometimes what we're seeing on social media and everybody in this state of panic can really bring you into it. And so you have to take a step back and say, you know, what is the reality of this situation here? And how should I appropriately prepare and take precautions without taking it to that level of being overwhelmed.